on Sekiralaga Shripala has long been growing eggplants. But in recent years, for him and his family here in Sri Lanka, a transformation in their lives. He's gained an assured market for his produce and from an unexpected source. The village has benefited so much from the Kandalama Hotel. We sell them vegetables and king coconuts. I get good money, so my family also benefits. Our image of tourism in the developing world. Luxury hotels consuming precious resources, exploiting local communities. But something remarkable is happening here, an initiative that shows what tourism can truly achieve. At first, when the Kandalama Hotel was built, people weren't keen on having a luxury hotel on their doorstep. They feared for their environment, but that soon changed. And here's why. Sustainable cinnamon wood from the villages used to boil water and generate steam at the hotel. Almost all the hotel's sewage water purified and sent back to the washroom, even purer than the local reservoir. Sixteen categories of solid waste sorted and sold locally. Food waste recycled for the local pig farm. Wet waste composted and used as vegetable fertiliser and even paper made from the local elephant dung. So the surrounding communities not only sell their produce to the hotel or get jobs there, the whole living environment benefits their economy also. Ranjit Kumar Singhi from a nearby village joined the hotel as a trainee waiter. Today he's a manager and during his time off he still works his land. For him, avoiding waste is the path to profit for the hotel. Now what we do is we go on uh, you know, bringing the waste into zero. Or if there's any waste, we make it as a resource to a different person or maybe to our own organization where you make money. Now, that is actually the sustainable development. The hotel has achieved 3% energy savings and 8% water saving over a three year period during which occupancy increased by half. And it hasn't happened by chance. They benefited from the support of Sri Lanka's National Cleaner Production Centre, set up by the United Nations Industrial Development Organisation, UNIDO, in close collaboration with Sri Lanka's government and the private sector. The centre's director, V. R. Sena Peris, believes cleaner technologies are key to development. Through cleaner production, we help these industries to reduce the, the wastage of resources and also wastage uh, of various uh, energy as well as water and through that they improve their profitability. They reduce their resource use and ultimately that reduces the emissions as well as disposals. So that means it's economically profitable, environmentally sustainable and socially responsible. And for the hotel, social responsibility implies a long-term view. They help develop this local primary school which will mean brighter prospects for the years to come. Sustainable tourism, if it's about protecting the environment, empowering the community, contributing to prosperity, then this is a model of how to make it happen.